feels good because um, you, you realize that you're helping out a huge cause. At this event, dozens of people had their heads shaved to raise money and awareness for childhood cancer, including a few who had it done for the first time. Brie Russo is not only donating 15 inches of her hair, but wants to show solidarity. I think it's really important for these kids fighting cancer to know that appearances don't matter, your hair doesn't matter, what's important is fighting with everything that you have and just having courage every day. Her reaction afterwards? I look pretty great. How yeah. How do you feel? I don't know, it's undescribable. St. Francis de Sales is donating over $20,000 to the foundation sponsoring the fundraiser, an organization that has already raised $200 million for cancer research. You'll have over 200,000 children this year be diagnosed with childhood cancer. And the sad part about it is four out of five of them won't beat the cancer. And the 20% that do will have all kinds of battles beating the cancer and have all kinds of side effects as they get older. Childhood cancer hits home for Bell Harbor parishioners like Danielle Kelly, whose 10-year-old daughter was diagnosed when she was only an infant. She does have some lasting effects from her treatment. So, and a lot of times people do make a big deal over something that she was so young when she was going through it and knows that she's never getting away from it. This is the first ever fundraiser of its kind at the parish, and Father James Cunningham says it's bringing the community closer together. The people in Bell Harbor are so generous and so supportive of so many initiatives, so it's really a great blessing for us. If you wish to donate, you can visit the Foundation's website at www.stbaldricks.org. Reporting for Currents from Bell Harbor, I'm Tim Harfman.